Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video I'm going to show you how to integrate Slack with GitHub. First thing, we have to create ourselves an account at slack.com if we obviously don't have one already. And once we are at our workspace, we want to go to the top left corner and we want to hit browse Slack. Now, once we click on browse Slack, we want to go all the way down to apps. Once we're here, we can search by name. So we are gonna start with GitHub. Uh, there's a server option or the ordinary one. Let's go with the ordinary one. We click on uh, GitHub and add to Slack and you just allow it. And this type of integration is already, it's, it's done, you've managed to do it. We can also use automate.eo. Uh, I will leave the link in the description underneath this video. And once we're here, we want to go to the top side of automate to integrations and go to the bottom left um, and click see all, uh, see all categories. Uh, we can pick from uh, 200 or more apps. So we want to start with uh, Slack here. And on the, op on the opposite side, as a counterpart, we will use GitHub, like this. As you can see, there's a couple of uh, popular integration already made for us. But if we won't be able to find the one that we are looking for, just keep scrolling down and uh, you will see uh, this option, create your own integration. Just remember, on the left side, underneath the triggers, you want to start with, uh, with Slack. On the right side, on the other hand, underneath the actions, you want to go with GitHub. So let's go with the first one, for example. And now what we have to do, we have to click on try it now. We could redirect it and ask to uh, log in to uh, automate.eo and you are a few clicks away from finishing this integration. We can also use zapier.com. At uh, zapier.com, uh, we also need to create ourselves an account. And uh, once we're done, we want to go to the top left corner and we want to make a zap uh, on this uh, black button. Now uh, we can name our zap or we don't actually have to, but let's jump straight to the integration. So trigger will be obviously Slack, like this. Trigger event, new public message, for example, let's go with the first one. Uh, now we have to pick an account like this. We hit continue and uh, trigger for bots or messages. No, so continue. Uh, now we can test the trigger. Uh, in the second action, uh, we want to go with GitHub, obviously. Action event, let's stick with the first one, continue. And the last thing is we have to sign in with GitHub and we are basically done. So thanks for watching and see you on the next video.